what's a holiday season without festive music? No silent nights here. Thanks to this Memphis natives latest work fans of live at nine. No Lily Brooks O'Brien best for her acting chops on stages and the small screen and she is here with her new Christmas EP. Welcome back day one -er. Yes, I am definitely a day one -er. I've been here. I love coming to live at nine. It's always such a nostalgic thing for me. I love it. So you were itty bitty. Oh my gosh, I was tiny. I think the first time I came, I was nine or eight or nine. Okay. Crazy. Well, Crazy. I, you have to tell me. So what made you record a Christmas album? I have always been a fan of Christmas music. Every time I come back home for the holidays, we uh, make Thanksgiving dinner and then we start listening to Christmas music. And I've just, the songs that are on my EP are songs that I've just always loved. And I've just, I was so excited to get to record them in my own take and get to release them out into the world. The songs that are on them are Last Christmas, Have Yourself a Merry Little Christmas, and Mary Did You Know, which is my absolute favorite Christmas song. I heard her practicing. So we're <laughs> going to get to hear your voice now. You've been in more than a dozen episodes of The Young and the Restless Y&R yeah, here on And a lot more to come, for sure. Ooh, I love to hear like what's happening. So talk to me about your character. Yeah, so Lucy Romilotti is the daughter of Daniel Romilotti Jr. Um, I've been having a lot of fun on in Genoa City recently. Um, lots of filming days, and it's just been so much fun to get to work with everyone, because everyone that's been working on Y&R has been working there for so long. Um, there's a makeup artist that has been working there since day one and he is so kind and I mean I just I love my character so much. I think she's so sweet and especially like her coming on to the show like I felt like it was a lot of life imitating art and I felt exactly what she was going through and it's been such a blast to get to play her and I can't wait for her to get into some some juicy things Ooh. on Y&R. <laughs> I always wondered you know they hear that uh, you hear that you they'll get the script you know and then it might change and so how do you yeah. adapt that's so hard I mean, just to have instant recall. Definitely. I mean, so the first time that you get the script, it's like it's one way and then you can get it two days later or right before the show and it'll be <laughs> totally different. And uh, uh, something that I experienced a lot during filming of the Big Show show, the first show that I did when I moved to the LA, big show show. Is it was a sitcom and while they were filming the show, they would literally give you a whole different line. They, they would come on to you while filming and be like, hey, instead of saying this line, say this. And the next take, you just have to remember it. And I think that was so crazy and definitely a learning experience for me. And something that I really think helped me with those experiences was musical theater. Wow, what? So, okay, so we're gonna hear a song from you. I know you, you're such a creative person. Um, what what do you see uh, down the road? Oh, uh, definitely an album. I'm really hoping because um, I, I I love writing music and I've been I've been doing it pretty much every day for the last year and a half and or less than that actually, and um, I just I love it so much. So an album for sure and hopefully some more acting gigs. I mean, I just, I love doing it. Working is my favorite thing. Like I love being on set. I love creating um, and getting to be creative. And I just, I love being on, I love working. Well, I thing. love hearing you sing. So we're gonna have to just end this right now so we can get you all mic'd yeah. up and have you sing and be sure to follow Lily Brooks O'Brien on Insta. All right, we'll hear you in a moment.